Steph Curry says, pump the brakes, pump the brakes, y'all. I want this is Charles on welcome me to the conversation. Today we're going to be talking about the Golden State Warriors. So recently Stephen Curry just came, he, he had like a press release where he basically said that, you know, we've been used to winning and we've been used to being the champions and being the hunted ones. But now this year we're playing with house money because we're now going to be going after the fear. We're going to be the hunters. And he says a lot of people have been overlooking us. And I think he's going to surprise a lot of people. This is what I said in the video before when we said, you know, the Empire Strikes Back. Well, I said a lot of people have been writing off the Golden State Warriors, and I don't know why. Yes, they lost Kevin Durant. They did lose Kevin Durant. But with, the, with them losing Kevin Durant, that just moves them back to the 73-9 and, and nine, uh, win team. Now, a lot of people may think, may watch this video and say, yeah, but they lost Iguodala. They're going to lose. They lost so many X, Y, and Z players. They just added D'Angelo uh, D'Angelo Russell. And how is that all going to work out? It's a new team. It's a new – yeah, that may be true, but they still have the championship core. These are the four people we, we need to pay attention to. They still have Steph, Stephen Curry. They still have Klay Thompson. They still have Draymond Green. And they still have Steve Kerr. That is the championship nucleus that, that's still in place. So for us, you know, as basketball fans, as sports fans, to overlook them, I don't really think that's a wise thing to do. You don't just overlook, you know, the Golden State Warriors. They're going to have a lot to say this season, and they're going to have a lot to say, I believe, in the playoffs when, playoffs, uh, when the playoffs roll around. Why? Because, number one, they've been there. Number two, they have two of the greatest shooters of all time and possibly the greatest shooter of the three ball of, of all time in Stephen Curry. So, And they have Draymond Green, who's the ultimate Army Swiss knife. So there's no way that a team with that much championship exposure and experience that have gone to the finals that many times that have been through the playoff that it you know that understand everything that it is to you know get to the mountaintop and then actually win it, it's hard to just overlook them because of the way that the field has changed yes there's a lot more you know parity there's a lot more balance in the NBA this season but I think we make a big mistake by overlooking the Golden State Warriors and that's what Stephen Curry uh, knows this year they don't have any expectations because everyone has written them off and that's why he says now we're playing with house money and we're just going to be going after other opponents a lot of people a lot of people are going to overlook them they probably might not prep as hard because they're they're too busy going to be they're, they're going to be too busy focused on the Lakers and the Clippers and maybe Houston and all these other teams and then overlook the team that's won three of the last five championships uh, in the last five uh, seasons so I, I think it's going to be really interesting. I think Golden State is going to shock a lot of people this coming season. And that's what I want to open open up the conversation to you, to you guys. This is not a radio station, so I can't ask you to call in. But the next best thing we can do is I'll definitely want to know in the comment section below, what do you think? How do you think Golden State is really going to fare this season? I really want to know what you guys think. Do you think they're, just, they're, they're, they're washed? Do you think their championship you know, run is over? Do you think they're, do you think they're going to make it out of the first round this year in the playoffs? Or do you think they're going to advance? That's what I want to know from you guys. I think they're going to really make some noise in the playoffs this year. I don't, I don't know if they're going to make it to the NBA Finals, but I definitely think they're going to shock a lot of people. And I think a lot of people are making a mistake by overlooking them and just focusing on the Clippers, the Utah Jazz, or the Nuggets and overlooking the Golden State Warriors. They have a two-time unanimous MVP on their team in Stephen Curry. Last time I checked, he is a baller, and he's going to have a lot to say about it this upcoming season. But I definitely want to know what you guys think. Again, this is Charles here. Thank you for watching, and catch you on the next episode. Peace.